We'll start. This is the exterior of the unit. It's hooked to my Jeep Wrangler two door. Easily towable. Go anywhere that Jeep can go, this unit will go with it. You'll see here there's a generator that's attached to it right now. I have that operable. Just wanted to show you that it does uh, can be self sufficient running off a generator. Generator is not coming this purchase. Just let you know we're running about 121 volts there with a 3500 inverter generator. Down below this shelf, I installed that shelf for storage. You can put anything on top of it, strap it down. Right at the hitch is going to be your propane tank. That's your supply for your gas stove that's on the other side. I'll show you in a minute. That is your storage battery. That battery will run all of your LED lighting without a generator or a power source when you have it hooked up to a shoreline. Um, it will do your LEDs. It won't run your air conditioner, but it will run the LEDs. We'll back up. There's where if you actually have cable, satellite, uh, plug service, wherever you're camping, you can plug it in there, um, hooks to the TV. Never used it, so I don't know if it works. There's your water, city water connection line, or if you had your hard line that comes in through the water. It bypasses the storage tank. There is a pump inside on the other side. If you do want to fill up the water storage tank, that way you can pump water out to the hose you'll see on the other side in a moment. Tire step goes up to the top where you get access to the tent and I'll pull that down in another video that is the tent platform probably a little dirty up there I haven't had a chance to clean up there um, you'll notice the tent like I said is brand new I've never slept in it um, you can even see the plastic on it where it's uh, at the bottom of the, the uh, galvanized aluminum there. there's your air conditioning unit up top it's uh, actually operational right now it's one of the exterior doors this is also a shoreline this is where you actually plug in your shoreline right now it's hooked up to a generator back side jacks stabilizer jacks those are manual come over to this side there is an exterior plug there you actually have the other exterior door this is the bat wing awning that's not deployed yet Here we have the pantry area. You open this up, store. You can see I haven't removed any of my stuff that I had from when I was camping. That's your water hose that you can use to spray down, wash dishes here if you need to. The pull out section of the cooking area. You slide that out from that doorway there. That's got your refrigerator slash freezer here. You can actually show you, I cut that on. It is operable. It will run off the generator. That will also run off the battery. Stove where your propane. See it's in very good condition. I've cooked maybe 12 times on it. A little storage area down there. I usually camp by campfire. Or cook by campfire. You'll notice that's the exterior plug for the gas line. It runs down to the back to the front with the propane tank. Of course, the generator is running now. I'll do another video for interior in the tent.